Welcome back everybody to the Shoe Enthusiast channel. The one thing that people ask me a lot when they see my pictures of my shoes on Instagram is they say, Mr. Shoe Enthusiast, how is it that your shoes always look so clean and pristine? And so I get this question so much that I'm like, well, I should make a video that kind of shares how I keep my shoes looking so clean and pristine. In fact, in this video, I'm going to give you three ways that you can keep your shoes in pristine condition. Let's get started. So, how do I keep my shoes so clean? So you can see here, this is a picture of my spectator shoes uh, that I show on Instagram uh, fairly often. And so, these are shoes people usually say is, how do you keep the white looking so white? And that, that's true. It's one reason why a lot of people don't get spectator shoes, because they don't know how to keep the white parts looking clean. And that, that's, that's fair. So one thing that I do that I think most of you could do that'll keep them clean the whole time is this. Most reputable shoe companies that you know are a little bit more expensive, I mean, not the really cheap ones, but kind of your mid-range you know, mid shoes, they should all come with something. And those are shoe bags. So what most people do with shoe bags is they store their shoes, like for example, if they have boots and the boots, you know, it's not boot season anymore or suede or whatever, when it's not the season, they'll put them in the dust bags and they'll, they'll kind of store them to keep dust off of them. I do one better than that. I actually take uh, the dust bags that came with the shoes and I put them on while I'm wearing them. So look at here. I'm walking around with them. I'm you know, going back and forth. As long as you keep the shoe bags on your shoes, they're not going to get dirty. And uh, doubly, you know, they're never going to get muddy. I mean, it's just never going to happen. Uh, they might get wet in the rain because as far as I know, most of the uh, shoe bags are not waterproof so that that's a bad thing that that being said though it's a really good idea to just wear your shoe bags on your shoes and on your feet while you wear them out you'll keep them real clean okay some of you may have thought okay shoe enthusiasts that's ridiculous i'm not going to wear shoe bags on my shoes because i want people to see my shoes and you know what you got me that's that's probably right i'm i should have thought about that so Another way that you can keep your shoes clean that don't involve you putting shoe bags on them, you can wear them whenever you want, any condition, but wear them inside the house. If you wear your shoes inside the house, how are they really going to get dirty? Wet? No, no. Your house keeps you dry, right? And though I would say you probably should walk on carpet because you have to think of the soles of the shoes. You want to keep those soles in pristine condition. You walk on a hard floor, it's going to start, you know, hitting the leather a little bit and it's not going to stay perfect. So I would say you want your shoes to stay clean, you got to wear them in the house, preferably on carpet, and don't take them out. So that that's a really good good way to keep your shoes clean. Now, some people say, okay, look, that's all fine and all, and I, okay, I want to wear my shoes in the house. They're going to say, but what about all the creases? Because that, that's an issue that I think a lot of people have. My shoes are not only clean, but you know, I'd like to say they're crease free, but you know, they get a few creases. But they say, well, what if I don't want creases? Creases make the shoes look awful. I mean, I think they add character to shoes, but I do admit there are people out there that don't like them. So they sometimes say, how can I stop all that creasing? So 
there is a way to almost guarantee your shoes will not crease and they'll stay in perfect clean condition. So here's what you do. So when you get your shoes, you take the box, you unbox the shoes, you take them out of the box, you look at them, and then immediately after that, you put the shoes into the shoe bags they came with and then put them back in the box and then put them in your closet and leave them there. By never wearing them, your shoes stay clean and they stay crease free. And think how great they'll look on Instagram if you want to show pictures of those shoes. You just take them out, put them on a table, snap a photo, Put them back in the shoe bags as soon as possible because they're possibly going to be exposed to air or something harmful like that. Put them back in the box and then stick them back in your closet again. That is the way to guarantee that your shoes will stay clean, crease free. So, you can wear the shoe bags on the shoes while you wear them outside. You can wear them inside only, preferably on carpet, or you can simply just keep them in the box the whole time and don't wear them, and that'll keep them in pristine condition. Of course, if you're just a usual person who actually does want to wear shoes, buy some conditioner and a horsehair brush. Condition them periodically and brush them. That's pretty much all I do. I'm not great at high shining. There are other channels that are way better at that than I am. So I hope you enjoyed a little bit of humor today. Uh, I'm in a funny kind of mood, but I think sometimes uh, in the shoe world, uh, we can sometimes be pretty serious, but you know what? It's all in good fun. All right, thank you everybody. Uh, if you have any comments, please put them in the comments section. I do respond to comments. I really hope you didn't stop mid video and then you're gonna put the comment down there saying, that I was ridiculed for wearing shoe bags on my shoes. I hope you got all the way to the end where I tell you for real not to do that, uh, but we'll see. Put your comments down there. I do answer my comments. Um, I like interacting with people who watch my channel. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can always check out my shoes uh, on my Instagram at the shoe enthusiast. It's the underscore shoe underscore enthusiast. Okay, everybody. Thanks again for watching.